This is the setup I'm using to test the thermoelectric coolers. Um, on the bottom, I have a water block that I made a few weeks ago in my last video. And on the barb fittings, I have a quarter inch fuel line that um, goes down to the SureFlow 1.4 gallon per minute diaphragm pump. And it's pumping the water and recirculating it through this uh, water tank that has about 10 gallons of water in it. It's about room temperature. Uh, I have an Aztec power supply that's feeding this power block here that's sitting at about 14.6 volts and uh, it can do 42 amps of current so current won't be an issue. Um, room temperature is about 23 degrees Celsius and what I have here for my thermoelectric coolers I'm testing is a Marlowe Industries DT12-8 which is about an 8 amp uh, thermoelectric cooler and I have a super cool module, which I don't think super cools around anymore, but it's a two-stage thermoelectric cooler. And you can see from the side here, the two stages, how they're stacked. But uh, let's test and see uh, first what the temperature of the water block is. But I have this piece of foam that's insulating my fingers from the uh, thermocouple. That way it won't uh, interfere with the measurement. I'm gonna press the thermocouple down against the water block and see what the temperature of the water block is. So it takes a, about a minute for the thing to settle out. But since there's not a whole lot of differential between the room temperature and the water block, it probably won't change very much. So it looks like we're doing about 22, 23 degrees C in the water block. Uh, I'm next gonna move the thermocouple to the Marlowe Industries single stage cooler. Press it against that surface. Let's see how cold we get. So it looks like about minus 19, minus 20 degrees C on the single stage Marlowe uh, Marlo, uh, DT12. So let's go ahead and move the uh, thermocouple to the super cool two stage, see how cold that gets. Looks like it's running around minus 39 degrees Celsius. So the next experiment will be actually to build a two-stage cooler out of uh, four, four of these uh, DT12s on the bottom stage. And I'm gonna put a single, single DT12 on the second stage. And there'll be this uh, big aluminum block to transfer the, the heat from the single stage down to the four bottom on the second stage. So that'll be the next experiment. Let's see how cold we can get it. Thanks for watching.